Hi, everybody. Uh, good afternoon. Uh, I'm Liu Chunlei from Shanghai, China. Uh, my topic is uh, how to support environment protection with uh, information technology in China. Uh, this is our website. Uh, OK. Uh, I think um, many guys know China is facing one of the most serious environmental issues. Uh, it's uh, billions of people impacted by this, uh, such as water. This is the from news from CCTV. Uh, the water quality of most of the river are the worst level in China. Uh, and also, the groundwater is polluted heavily. Uh, for the air, yeah, uh, more than 1 million and 200,000 people died earlier due to the air pollution in China. Uh, you, you can see the Shanghai uh, is uh, in haze. And the farmland. More than 50 million acres of farmland are heavily polluted in China. Uh, yeah, we, we know the, the environment issue is very, uh, very uh, uh, serious. This is also uh, my example, the haze of days in uh, 2013. Uh, um, we know uh, every, almost every day we can find such issue from the newspaper or the TV, but we are not sure. Uh, for, for citizens, they are not sure what exactly the environment around, around him um, and uh, how to resolve the, such policy issue in a rapid way because you know some, there are some relationship between the government and uh, the factory. It's not so easy to, to resolve this issue. So this is why I left uh, Actor Lucent. Uh, I worked there for more than eight years to start uh, this job. Uh, I want to help people uh, in the following way. Uh, out of our million users, we can find uh, uh, richer how to turn maps, how to help him and uh, resolve some, something. Uh, he, he wants some uh, uh, apartment, so he searched one uh, real estate uh, website and found, oh, this apartment is okay. But he wants to know whether it's safe or not. Then he go to the map and to search, um, input the address and uh, search. Then he will find there many, uh, not, not many, uh, in, for some site, yeah, uh, there are some pollution uh, issues around. Uh, so he need to uh, reconsider this uh, uh, choice. He need to uh, search again. Uh, after uh, some uh, sometimes uh, searching, he may he found uh, one apartment is okay, but uh, after some some months, he found the water really some bad smells. So uh, he bought some water testing kits on Taobao and start to sample the water. Uh, the result is varying. So uh, he upload this uh, result. Uh, with the smartphone onto the uh, data map uh, and shared this map to his neighbors and also Weibo SNS. Uh, then the, the neighbors gathered together and have a meeting. They decided to walk along the river to, to find the root cause, why it's polluted, why it's bad smells. Uh, yeah. And finally, they found one factory is releasing the pollution water directly without any uh, uh, deals. Uh, they put the exact uh, position of the factory on the data map and uh, search the uh, cell phone, uh, the, the phone number of the uh, EBP, uh, EPB and uh, try to push them to stop this factory, to stop this pollution. Um, but it's not so easy. Uh, just as I said, there are some complex relationship between the government and the factory for some tax or some other reasons, uh, corruption and so on. So uh, they need uh, 
continue, you need to go on to push and uh, uh, go on to search maybe more pollutions. Yeah, this is uh, the current data map. They can help. It can help. It can help to uh, found some uh, the, the pollution around and uh, to gather the neighbors to solve it. And uh, now there are more big, big companies also involved, such as Alibaba. They prompt their uh, this this tour and the water test kits to their employees. So, so uh, last year, we have tested uh, uh, 420 locations around, uh, across 28 provinces. And also uh, more majors and foundations involved, such as South Sea Weekly, uh, uh, Dongfang Zaobao, uh, DF Daily, and SDE Foundation, and so on. And also, uh, there are many NGO are using this tool to identify these uh, pollution and uh, root cause. Yeah. Um, but uh, uh, the citizens uh, think it's not uh, good enough, so they need uh, better services. Uh, so we planning the following features. Uh, not only know whether there are pollution, uh, there are factories, but know exactly is there any record for the pollution and what is the real time water gases released and whether it exceeded the threshold. With this information published, uh, so the real estate develop developers, uh, many of them are millionaires or billionaires, uh, can help to control the uh, pollution because this will impact the price of their uh, their apartment. Uh, as, uh, also, currently, there are many data uh, controlled by government, but they did not publish uh, and or in a not convenient way. So we need to uh, uh, submit an application to open the data and uh, uh, show them, uh, dig and analyze and show them to the citizens in a convenient way. And uh, also, um, we need, uh, we, we, we have the air quality and road quality uh, with real time history and trend. Yeah. And uh, also, we need to uh, know if there are any good things around us, not only bad things, so we can give people some hope. And also, comments about the environment from the local citizens. Uh, when he found some pollution issue, uh, he can share this information to uh, also NGOs and uh, medias because this, uh, they, they will help them to, fix this, uh, to resolve this issue. And we will preset the phone number, email, Weibo, and Weixin in the APP so they can contact the partners in a really rapid way to speed up the, 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 the soul. And if the citizen contribute to a local environment, reach some criteria, he will get some gifts from some big company. This company, these big companies uh, treasure their brand and uh, uh, want to make their brand environment friendly. So in this way, uh, also, the uh, employees of these big companies can be involved with the meetings, I think. And uh, there, in, in China, there are also many NGOs for environment protection. Uh, we will design a um, uh, mechanism so they can be involved in a more deeper way, so we can uh, support uh, each other and also impact their funds. Uh, the draft plan, uh, the a new open interactive data maps with solid data uh, will, be, will be built in the uh, following uh, way. Um, because China, there, there are many provinces, so we want to uh, run in this way. And uh, then we want to implement, implement it 
in, with this architecture. So with the air quality, water quality, land quality, and the pollution sources, uh, all data will be collected into the OpenDB. Open means open to the third party NGO uh, and uh, other uh, stakeholders. Uh, and then with the EPP and the web, uh, this information can, can uh, easily be shared or feedback to the government factory and the reporters. So uh, citizens can know the uh, overall environment around, uh, around us and also action to change them in a rapid, uh, in a rapid way. Uh, technically, we will implement this uh, uh, with uh, such uh, technologies. Uh, including DB, uh, Node.js, Virus, and also hybrid APP, Binders, and so on. Uh, that's the technical uh, architecture. Um, yeah, that, that's all. Thank you. Mm -hmm.